a token from early 1900s. People are like, whoa, that's what it used to look like. So that's kind of what got me really excited about collecting all the vintage stuff. They were like little treasures. I'm Brian Kelly. I'm a commercial photographer, and one of my passion projects is focused around New York City Transit Authority ephemera. So a majority of my time and energy gets put into my still life work. I do a lot of commercial merchandise, like shoes and clothing and stuff like that. And then from there, when I have my downtime, you know, I have a week off with no client work, that's when I can really dive into my archive work. I started the New York City Transit Authority project seven years ago, randomly just started collecting Metro cards. That project has now led to a bunch of other ones as well. I feel like so much stuff in today's world is created specifically to be like instantaneous. Why not take your time and actually make it awesome? Like you made something, it's tangible, it's real. So that was probably for me the best feeling about making the book. You have to balance everything in life. For myself and my photography and my archiving, you could almost look at the projects as like kids. You know, I have like five kids because <laughs> I have five different projects going on. I listened to the tutorialist give an interview and he said, as a photographer, you have a hidden obligation to document the time and space around you. I think time's the most valuable thing you can have.